McLaren Automotive, the British creator of luxury sports cars and supercars, is to offer a track-only version of the new Ultimate Series McLaren Senna, to be called the McLaren Senna GTR. Unveiling the McLaren Senna GTR concept at the 2018 Geneva International Motor Show, McLaren Automotive CEO, Mike Fluitt, confirmed that up to 75 examples of the most extreme McLaren car ever will be hand-assembled in Woking, England, during 2019. Excelling on the track underpins the heritage of the McLaren brand and is as important and relevant today as it has ever been, explained Mike Fluitt. The track-only McLaren Senna GTR will have more power, more grip, and more downforce, up to 1,000 kg, than the McLaren Senna and post even faster lap times. The very limited number of customers who secure this car will be buying the closest experience you can get to a race car without actually lining up on a circuit grid. Expressions of interest will be taken at the Geneva show and thereafter, with exact technical details of the McLaren Senna GTR confirmed later this year. Based around the same carbon fiber monocage 3 structure as the McLaren Senna to ensure the core strength and rigidity needed for a top flight track car, the McLaren Senna GTR will be similar in weight to the 1,198 kg lightest dry total of the road legal McLaren Senna. With more power and greater torque from the 4.0-liter twin-turbocharged V8 engine than the 800 PS and 800 NM developed in the road car, horsepower will increase to at least 825 PS, the car will be faster than the standard model in a straight line. The additional benefit of a race-style transmission, revised double wishbone suspension and Pirelli slick tires, together with up to 1,000 kg of downforce, will ensure that the McLaren Senna GTR will also post the quickest McLaren circuit lap times outside Formula 1. The form follows function McLaren design philosophy that is at its strongest in the McLaren Senna provides, quite literally, the ideal platform for the McLaren Senna GTR. The car will have a wider track and new fenders front and rear, the changes to the carbon fiber body simplified by the fact that the fenders and other aerodynamic components have been designed as clipped onto the cockpit structure, allowing relatively easy modification. The McLaren Senna GTR will also feature a new wheel design, developed specifically for circuit use. The front splitter of the McLaren Senna GTR concept is larger than the road car component and contributes to improved front aerodynamic performance as does the rear diffuser which is both larger and extends further back. The rear deck is the lowest of any McLaren and aids both aerodynamic performance and cooling, as well as helping to optimize the performance of the active rear wing. The design of the doors benefits aerodynamic efficiency, the outer skin being pushed in as far as possible towards the center of the car to better channel airflow. Unlike the road legal McLaren Senna, the McLaren Senna GTR will feature a polycarbonate ticket window. The McLaren Senna was designed from the outset with the full spectrum of road and track requirements in mind, so developing a GTR version is within the scope of the original project, explained McLaren Automotive Design Engineering Director, Dan Perry Williams. The McLaren Senna GTR concept unveiled in Geneva is not the finished article but it does give a clear indication of our thinking for the car, which promises to be the most extreme and exciting McLaren to drive for many years, if not ever. McLaren Automotive is increasing its focus on providing customers with track-based driving experiences across its full range of cars. A single-make race series has been launched as part of the program of pure McLaren track events, allowing McLaren owners with the minimum of an international degrade license to take advantage of a full arrive and drive package to race in a 570s GT4 car. To support this and other motorsport activities, a network of McLaren retailers specializing in selling and fettling McLaren's motorsport models has been established, initially 10 in number, the retailers serve Europe, North America, and Asia-Pacific.